Hi, I'm Kella Means, LucasArts project lead on LEGO Indiana Jones 2 The Adventure Continues. We're really excited to bring you this game. Traveler's Tales has done a great job bringing Indiana's friends back for the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. You're able to play through that story for the very first time. We're also going back and retelling the original movies. All new content, nothing's recycled from LEGO Indy 1. There's also some great vehicle chases, boss battles, split screen co-op, and for the very first time in a LEGO game, you're able to build your own adventure. So let's check out our builder today, your ability to become your own game developer and create your own LEGO Indie level. So here we are in the builder. Um, you've got your alien landscaper guy and this guy can raise and lower the terrain. He can make mountains and he can make uh, pools of lava or water. You're also able to push out those walls um, to make a larger play area. Molaram's gonna run in, he's gonna push out some walls. You can see that we've got some pre-populated stuff for you here, but you can build whatever you want. So he's pushed that out. Now we've got a base plate guy. He can put down Lego grass, um, roads, tracks, intersections, basically whatever uh, ground you want for your, uh, your level. And if you don't like the orientation of where you put that plate, you can always pick it back up and change it. And you can copy and paste some of those Lego trees and shrubs and, and whatever props you put down. You can have pretty much whatever you want to your level. Bushes, flowers, shrubs, whatever you want. You've got a countless array of Lego items to put in your very own level. And you're also able to assign actions to objects. Say I want to put down a trap, a giant spike trap, or a saw trap. I can attach it to a button and once in play mode, that button will affect the trap. So here we're gonna assign this button to a trap and in play mode, whoever's playing your level will be able to activate that. So you can make a pretty complex little level here. So these little builder guys help you out and you see the menu here. Um, you're easily able to toggle between the guys and also um, whatever features you wanna add to your very own Lego level. One of the cool things you can do in build mode is set down enemies that come to life once you enter play mode. So here we've got Molaram, he's going to put some enemies that are going to charge at us once we're in play mode. He's got the ability to lay down animals, uh, characters, vehicles. So we'll get a couple guys in there. Nice little car, maybe a camel. So now we're going to jump into play mode and see how some of the things that we've just created come to life. So here Indy and Marion are in play mode. You see those traps that we set and the enemies we set down are charging at us. We've got a camel there to ride around on or we can jump in our car. And you'll see that that button as well that we um, put down for that trap activates the saw trap. So you made that happen as your very own game developer. So this is similar to the tools that Traveler's Tales actually uses to create their levels for LEGO Indy. And you can toggle between build and play and check out how your level's progressing. So here we are, our alien landscaper has dug a giant pit here. I think we're gonna fill this pit with lava. We're putting some enemies down to see what'll happen. Um, let's go into uh, play mode and see what happens to these guys once the pit fills full of lava. So they're all coming to life here. They're coming after me. We've got this guy, the lava pit's filling up. Let's see what happens. We can whip target this guy. Indy's gonna throw him over his shoulder throw him into this pit of lava. So let's check out some of the other cool traps. We've got a rocket launcher and some radioactive traps. Let's check out in play mode what happens with that rocket launcher. We're running back over. That is definitely a rocket launcher. So a brand new feature for this game is split screen co-op. For the first time ever in a LEGO game, you're able to go to different areas of the level. We're able to build in different areas, put down some trees and flowers, whatever we want to do. But if we get lonely for one another, we can run back towards the center line there and seamlessly pop, we're right back together. As you can imagine, this is fun. This is a great feature to play with your friends. And I think adding this feature to the game is gonna solve a lot of sibling rivalries out there with LEGO fans. So there you have it. The builder from LEGO Indiana Jones 2, The Adventure Continues. Hopefully you can see that the possibilities are truly limitless with what you can build with this great new feature. We're excited to bring you this game. It's coming out in the fall. I hope you guys enjoy it and see what you can build.